guys, Robin from Rainbow Gardens, and we are going to talk today about cicada killers. Now, cicada killers are one of the largest wasps in the United States. They uh, can reach about an inch and a half long, and they are considered beneficial insects because they do uh, prey on adult cicadas. So right now, the female cicadas, they've got two main jobs. They're digging and burrowing under the ground, and then they're also um, paralyzing cicadas, bringing them down into their nest uh, to feed the, their little cicada killer larvae. Uh, you know, the, the females do have a stinger, and they, uh, that stinger is just to uh, get those cicadas. Now, you would have to work really, really, really hard to get her to come after you and sting you. She would have to feel very, very threatened. The males have no stinger whatsoever. They are kind of hanging around the nests, waiting for the ladies, and uh, they might uh, bump into you, uh, you know, making you think, hey, I'm tough. But honestly, they have no stinger. They can do absolutely nothing to you. The cicada killer tunnels are actually quite impressive. Um, they, uh, the tunnels have a distinctive U-shaped collar of loose soil around the opening. Uh, individual tunnels can range from 70, sorry, 30 to 70 inches and may run 12 to 15 inches below the surface. Um, and the first chamber is about a foot or so from the entrance. And there's an average of 15 egg shaped side chambers. Um, each one containing one larvae and about three of the uh, paralyzed cicadas. Um, and then the egg, of course, of course, which hatches in a couple of days. And there's a little grub-like wasp larva that comes out and it'll feed for about 10 days on those cicadas, leaving only the cicadas outer shell. And during the fall, uh, the larvae spins a silken case, shrinks and prepares to overwinter and the development will be complete when the wasp emerges next summer. So there's only one generation per year. So these guys are working on our cicada killers for next year. And again, we really need these guys because they help control the cicada population. Uh, a lot of our trees and shrubs and things would be destroyed without them. So we really do need them. Um, they are not harmful to you. Uh, they just want to go about their business. So please let them do that. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.